oh gosh, I just got done with the work challenge and it was awesome. I think I did it in 50 minutes, but it's okay because I didn't hurt my back. I didn't tweak it and I feel so darn good for doing it. And even though I had to like make a few adjustments, it's okay, that's, that's great. You can make adjustments, that's part of life. Don't worry about like modifying or don't worry about like, you know, um, not being perfect because there's nothing in this world that's perfect. I mean, look, I got that on the thing. That's for my, my um, pull-ups. I got down on my knees for my push-ups. I was going for form rather than perfection, all right? And I didn't get hurt, so I was going for safety. And I also did the elliptical instead of running outside a mile and another mile at the end because that's what I needed to do to protect my back. I didn't need any jarring going on. So that's what you do. So trust me, whenever you hear me say there's no shame in the modifying game, that's what I mean. All right, so have a great Memorial Day and thanks for all your amazing service. I am so grateful to every, which, every one of you guys that is out there helping us and just protecting our country and you know, uh, the reason why I choose to do the Murph Challenge is because I took care of a, uh, sh uh, a shooter, basically, um, whenever I was working um, in, at the hospital, and his stories were uh, pretty, pretty uh, significant to me. And um, you know, I just saw the pain, and I saw the things that you know they have to endure in his eyes like I felt them and I saw them in his eyes and you know it's amazing that um, you know that this guy that we're honoring today you know basically is you know a hero and um, you know I just I just wanted to you know make sure that I did it again because I never want to forget you know what everybody does that's out there in the armed forces and that are protecting our country because it's it's pretty amazing and so if you're listening to this and you are someone in the armed forces or if you've been in the armed forces i just want to say that i'm truly grateful for everything that you've done